Well, we are ready for ride two of the Battle of the Bulls Tour. Unfortunately, in our ring here, and we do hope that your weather is better when you are here, but it should clear up this afternoon. Um, we always start our rides at a petrol station, so you are ready to go for your ride. And this ride is 200 kilometers, 180 miles. And we are going to take you to the neighboring country, Luxembourg, also known as the Biker Paradise. And this ride is the fifth World War II Battle of the Bulls Memorials, but also some nice stops for coffee and lunch. So, let's go crazy! Clairvaux is an absolute highlight of Luxembourg, especially with its Clairvaux Castle, just around the corner from the uh, parking that we added to your GPX file. But you might be able to park your bike somewhere on the sidewalk. And of course you can go just in the city to have a drink, cup of coffee, tea, but you can also go into the castle where you can find a Battle of the Bulls museum. So in the courtyard of this fairy tale like castle, you find this Musée de Bataille des Ardennes. And for just a few euros, you can visit it. But we've got some other plans.
you have added this stop in Clairvaux to have a Kodak moment with the castle built between the 11th and the 14th century. And uh, even in weather like this, we've got everything. We've got rain and sun. Um, it is a good point to take your picture. And if you are sharing pictures, remember to use the hashtag CrazyWrites. The uh, castle has been restored and there is a museum, but not a Battle of the Bulls museum. So we settle for the view. Oh, and blue skies! Let's go there! <laughs> no, we're going there! <laughs> that I could borrow your dance mind. <laughs> well, thank you very much. My feet are soaked. <laughs> completely dry. But we're going to dig here to see if we can have lunch and find the donkeys. Oh yeah, something with donkeys. First, we want to show you this museum, the Musée National d'Histoire Militaire. We are not visiting this museum, as we have another one further on in the right that we hope to get to in time. But we read that they have a few uh, vehicles on display, so we wanted to see if we can get a picture with one of them. Well, and you can get a picture with a few of them. Diekirch is a charming town on the river Suur and it's really nice to have a walk through the pedestrianated area, grab a terrace and maybe even a cool blonde Diekirch beer, local beer. And look for donkeys. It is not entirely sure why, but the donkeys are very important to Diekirch. And according to the most likely story, the farmers use donkeys to work on their fields and vineyards as that was the only way to um, do the heavy work. But according to another anecdote, the Dikir people were called stubborn donkeys because they protested against the railway. Whatever you believe to be true, I am sure that you will see some donkeys if you have a little walk through Dikir. The most famous donkeys are these four dancing donkeys in this fountain. And it's said that on special occasions, there's no water, but beer flowing in this uh, fountain.
Well, and next to the village of Eschi sur Sur, we have this reservoir, the Lac de la Hoogtje. And as you can see, well, the arms of the reservoir cut into the uh, Ardennes hills, like, uh, like fjords. It's quite spectacular. And this reservoir uh, is good for 70% of all the water needed in the Dutch Back in Belgium, we have one last stop in the theme of the Battle of the Bulls tour, this Bastogne War Museum. It has a contemporary, interactive context of the causes, events and consequences of World War II, and in particular, the Battle of the Bulls. Last entry here is four o'clock, in July and August, five o'clock. So if you're late and you really want to visit this museum, come back because it's only 30 kilometers, 19 miles from La Roche. Just behind the museum, and all is open, you will find this Memorial du Mas d'Asson, a Battle of the Bulls memorial honoring the American soldiers fallen on Belgian soil during World War II. It has the shape of a five-pointed star, 31 meters long. Normally, you would be able to go up to the platform to have the panoramic view of all the defending posts here in the area of Bastogne. Unfortunately now they are renovating it so we can't show you yet. Underneath the memorial you will also find this crypt which is special because it has three altars, a Catholic, Protestant and Jewish altar, all decorated with these beautiful mosaics. War belongs at the museum. So, another beautiful ride filled with Battle of the Bulls memorials. We hope you liked it and please let us know if you did. We hope that you liked this video and if you did, please hit that like button and consider subscribing to the channel so you won't miss our future videos on crazy rides. And if you want to keep going crazy now, we also have a tour in Normandy, France that we have called Monet's Trail. Right one is in the middle of the screen.